Okay, so we have two race cars here. We have the Mustang and the Camaro, and their speed after this many seconds. So the seconds go from zero to four, so we can just do our regular numbering at the bottom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nothing changed there. Now the speeds go as high as 60. So I'm just gonna go, you know, zero is always here. I'm just gonna go by tens, just to make it a little bit easier. 30, 40, 50, 60. And we don't need to go any higher than that since the highest is 60. So let's look at the Mustang first. Mustang has one at zero, zero. One, after one second, it's going 10 miles an hour. After four seconds, it's going 40 miles an hour. Let's look at the Camaro. We'll do yellow in honor of Bumblebee. So we have one at zero, zero. We have one at one comma 12. So just a little bit above this one. And then we have one at four comma 60. And once again, these both look pretty close. So let's draw lines through both of them and see which one looks the best. So let's start with the green. This is the Mustang. That one looks pretty good. Let's try now with the yellow. Oh, no, that one's off. Sounds too high. So we know it's definitely the data set that is more linear is the Mustang. So the Mustang. Has the more linear. data set. 